I am a party clown. I think we're related. I'm gonna marry you. We are not on the same page. Okay, here's the deal. I've been wanting to end things with Claire for years now, and I'm gonna do it. It's gonna take one phone call. What? She's gonna burn all my clothes on the lawn. I don't care. I only want to wear Henleys anyways. Jess, we can finally be together. What? Wait, no. Leave your wife? For you. I'm gonna leave my wife for you. Wait, what? Thank you for being so incredible. So lucky to have you in my life, Jess. When you said those words, I knew. Berkeley, there's been a fundamental misunderstanding here. You know the last time Claire thanked me for anything? It was when I was pulling out her chair at our wedding. No. She doesn't appreciate me like you do. It's not happening. No, no. Ah! Damn it, Winston! Oh, God. Pretend this is attached and there's water coming out. Okay. No, not like that. It's not sexual. No, I'm not feeding you water. Wet my mouth. No. Hey. Hey. That's my shirt. No, this is my t-shirt. No, that is my shirt. It has my name on it. Don't drop it. Just don't, don't drop it. Come on, get everybody out. Oh. 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 Give me my shirt. Come on, my shirt. Hey, Jess, no, 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 stop, stop, stop. Sorry, oh. don't mind us, pal. We're just here for the TV. Who are these guys? They're my roommates. Cece, hi. I'm gonna go in and get the rest of your stuff, hey. Jeff. Wait, just let's just talk about this, okay? You know, wrap it out. No, we can't wrap it out. We're not together anymore. It's not the same. This means we can't talk about things. There's nothing to talk about. Give me my shirt back. No, you gave this to me. I want to keep it. Give her a t-shirt, man. No, I don't want to, you know? And I gave her this hat, too, so I'm going to have to take this back. This one? Yeah. You want that? Yeah. Then I dare you. Come take it off my head, pal. I dare you. You guys look ridiculous. Look, dude, give her the shirt back. I bet she worked hard on that jamboree. Yeah, play on words. Jamboree. Jam. 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 Girl made a lot of jam, Spence. You know how time consuming that can be? You need a jar funnel, a canner, some fresh fruit, strawberries, raspberries, maybe a tayberry, maybe a ripe. No more fruit, man. You live with these people, Jess? Seriously? You can stay here until you find a better place to live. You know what? I don't like you, Stretch. I don't like anything about you, and I'm not afraid to. I got this. I've got a place to live, Spence. It's over. I spent six years trying to figure you out. All you are is a guy with really beautiful hair. I'm happy you cheated on me. Thank you, because if you hadn't, I would have married you. And then you would have hurt me all over again. Hi, uh, I'd like to say something, too. Jack's been dabbing. Um, I'd like yeah, to report a missing item. My heart. It was stolen by that little heart thief right there. Hmm. I'm, I'm innocent. I didn't. I was framed. I just want to say in front of God and all these people at this gorgeous party that I'm in love with you. No. No. And I know it's nah. early, but I think I met the girl that I'm gonna marry. Who? Who? I'm gonna marry you! <laughs> we are not on the same page. I'm gonna marry you. I'm gonna put a baby in you. We're gonna have dogs and cats. I met my third wife! Hey, Robbie. Do you ever think it's like... It's not good that we're so similar? I don't know. You know, my great uncle Chef Wallingford used to say, you buy the horse that you see in the mirror. Did you say Wallingford? Mm -hmm. I have Wallingfords in my family, out near Boston. Oh, mine are in uh, Newburyport. They were kind of like local celebrities. They're well known for making women's watches. watches. How'd you know that? Wallingford watches. Watches, because the, the time, time is now, now and the look is wow. <laughs> Robbie, I think we're related. I feel like we have a real connection. Me too. I know it's only the first day of your trial period, but my gut is telling me you're a perfect fit. I just like, I'm so happy here I could cry, but the gray water bucket's too far away and I want to save my tears to water these plants. That's good. <laughs> oh! 
My partner's here to pick me up. I think you're going to really like him. Sorry I'm late. The string came out of my prayer beads and they just bounced all over the office. Oh. So frustrating. Sam, I want you to meet Jess. This is the candidate we were discussing in the shower. Jess, yeah. this is Sam, my partner. Hey, Jess. You're a doctor for children. That's, you know, mostly paperwork. How do you always look so beautiful in the morning? Thanks. Mm -hmm. You're there. Oh, oh my god! Oh, you could have killed him! I'm gonna kick your ass, man! Hi, Hi, Sam. Have you met before? We yeah, we've met. We did, yes. That's right, we met. We met. <laughs> Funny. Um, a bunch of times. A lot of times. Very many, a lot of times. We met a lot, yeah. Sometimes in the day, sometimes in the uh nighttime. Oh. It was you know. Yeah, we I mean Yeah. Oh. Bye, Jess. Nice to see you. So yeah, I got promoted to vice principal, VP. Great. I have a bottle of soy sauce on my desk, so no more packets for me. And you got a little roly poly bug on you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I get it. What? I was important yesterday. You think we're on a walk of shame? Oh, I didn't, but... Congratulations! You spend your Sundays having cupcake parties at your beautiful house with your cute little half-Asian kid and your daddy diaper bag. Think someone might need a visit from the rest police. <laughs> Just because I don't have a husband or a baby or a house doesn't mean I'm not living right. We're still growing and changing, and that's a good thing. Look at this hair. This is single girl hair. This is adventure hair. This is a boring, married, settled hair. This is, this is fun. We're fun. You know what I did last night? I got totally obliterated and I made up a musical fable with a guy named Bear Claw and it was better than sex. I'm a little fox, but I'm not that sly. What can I say? I'm an honest little guy. Well, I'm glad things are good. You know what, Kinsler? I don't care what you think of me because this is my journey. Welcome to my freaking journey. Right, I wish you luck. You ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not Jen. Nope. This is not my house, okay? This is not a daddy diaper bag. This is a bag of sadness. Because I am a party clown. I'm actually a musical party clown, okay? So no one's had a more shameful walk this morning than me. What happened to Jen? Thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> Salt in the wound. She left me. You know what I did last night? I'm gonna tell you. I masturbated to pornography that I had to draw on the back of an envelope. <laughs> <laughs> He's great with kids. Who are you? I will Liza Minnelli impersonate her. <laughs> ah! So. When you first started working, I thought it was gonna be fine. I was over it, and then the more time we spent with each other, it just all came rushing back. And you're choosing to tell me this now? We've been together literally every day for the past week and a half. Yeah, I shouldn't be telling you any of this, but I also know that if I didn't, I'd regret it forever. Russell, I am in love with Nick 100%, okay? This is not puppy love. This is old-ass dog love. Do you remember your first date with Nick? You ran into me sign and i asked you both to write down what you meant to each other on the back of some ballet ticket you kept those i think you should look at those before you get married neither of you were ever sure about this not really not deep down just be with me let me give you the life you deserve let me make you happy let me make you dead you son of a bitch ah! Wow, Jess, that dress, you look so beautiful. But your eye, what happened to your eye? Oh, Did this I... son of a bitch steal your eye? Okay. No, no, I hurt my eye, and then my mom Ugh. gave me some of that sweet Cortland Bomba. Look, Nick, I love you. I have no feelings for Russell. But how could you not? He is so handsome. I mean, look at him. He's physically outstanding, and it's all my fault because I brought the curse on us. Did the curse make you more handsome? Yeah. That's my question to you. He is physically incredible. Nick, please don't fight him. We both know you're gonna lose. Let's do this. Let's do this. I got your back, man. Oh, yeah, Let's do lucky it. for you. Thanks. I'm packing. Oh, yeah. I can take all three of you. I kick. I kick really hard. You're all so bad at fighting. Oh.